girls. Here's what he did a bad, bad thing. Now listen, we, we're tired of you being a bad guy. We are going to mop the floors of Frontierland with you. What are you talking about? And it won't be tough considering what you're wearing for pants. Look at those. Oh, come on. Why do you have to hit below the belt like that? Where else do you wear something like that? I wear them right here. Oh, for crying out loud. Listen, why don't you organize the people? I'll get the soapbox and you and I can settle this like a couple of men. Fine, we will. Yeah. Folks, if you're in Frontierland, we need you to move on up to the edge of the cobblestones here. We do have to stop traffic coming through on either side. The mayor and I, we got a score to settle. We need witnesses for what's about to happen in the streets of our town. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, first of all, let me take this opportunity as your mayor to welcome each and every one of you to Frontierland. Applause. Applause. Thank you. Sam McGillicuddy's many, the once and future mayor of Frontierland, less than one half hour ago, this man, Clint Clodhopper, done a bad, bad thing when he welched shut his promise to marry my precious baby daughter, Sally Mae McGillicuddy. Boo, I say, boo, I say, and the people boo with me. Boo! Oh, now that's not fair. That's mudslinging. Not if it's true. Well, I got a perfectly valid explanation why I didn't marry your daughter, Sally Mae. Look, a lot of us were here earlier. We saw how this transpired. Go ahead, remind us. How come you ain't gonna marry Sally Mae? Well, I've seen her. All right. Now, hold on. I ain't no prize myself, but his daughter, Sally Mae, she could scare a hungry dog off a meat wagon. All right. She could make a train take a dirt road. Happened one time. When your daughter was born, they asked her, they asked you, is it a boy or a girl? And the doctor said no. All right. <laughs> you weren't even there. True story, though. Now, listen, here's the thing. At the same time, he challenged me to the position of mayor of this city, and I won't stand for that neither. Let's discuss the issues. The big issue is crime. I am again it. Clodhopper, get up there, Fuzzy. Tell them what you do about crime in Frontierland. Folks, crime in Frontierland, I'm not going to do a darn thing about it. Woo! Okay, of course you're gonna get the support of the criminal element. Big deal. Hey, we don't have any crime in Frontierland. I mean, when was the last time that our bank was even robbed? The bank has been robbed! This is my daughter, Sally Mae, everybody. Oh, Hi, God. honey. We was talking about you. What's all the screaming and yelling about? Daddy, tragedy has struck some traitors. Treacherous Village just robbed the first federated franchise Frontierland Bank. Lim Clodhopper, yeah. you stood up on that box. You said there'd be a drop in crime. I did. Look at that, citizens. Broke his first campaign promise. Ain't even been elected yet. That's what he does, Daddy. He breaks promises. He broke his promise to marry me. And I don't know where I'm going to find true love now, Daddy. But I'm willing to try with this fella. How you doing? Honey, 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 honey. Just because he's scared doesn't mean he's interested. Um, now listen, here's what we've got to do. We've got to solve this. Well, get the sheriff. That's the problem. We don't have a sheriff. Why not? Well, honey, we ain't got no crime. We ain't never needed a sheriff. Well, you need one now. Wait a minute, I got an idea. You, Chia Chaps, up on the box. Okay. Raise your right hand. There it is. Your other right. Oh, I'm bilingual. All oh, right. <laughs> power to invest in me in the proclamation of the Constitution, I appoint you, Sheriff of Frontierland, as your new sheriff. Oh. I'm going to be the best sheriff this town's ever seen. I sure do fancy a lawman, Clem. Give me a smooch. I quit. No, 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 listen. <laughs> Responsibility to these people, and you act like the sheriff. All right, now listen, Sally. You're the only witness of this crime. You got to tell what you said. I ain't got to do nothing for you, Claude Hopper. You go and trample on my delicate little heart. I tell you what, I will do though. What's that? Beat you senseless. Oh, honey, oh. don't get all ugly. Oh, it's too late. All right. <laughs> We're in the middle of a crisis here. Now do something. Right, I'm sorry, Sally. I apologize. I got an idea. You've always wanted to be an actress. So? Why don't we do a dramatic reenactment of the event? We can figure out who the bank robber was. You know what? That's a pretty good idea, Clem. All right, I'll take you through it. First things first. Ah, sashayed into that bank, and there he was! The bank robber! Oh, no, Daddy. This was the bank manager. Oh, let me think real hard what the bank manager looked like. Well, he was a young, handsome fella wearing a black ball cap and some eyeglasses and... Stand Come over on. here now. You can relax. I ain't gonna bite. Not anytime soon, anyway. Now, look. <laughs> you just do what I tell you. This will be real easy. Now, I sashayed into that bank. That bank manager, he took a look at me, and then he said this. He said, that Sally Mae, go ahead and say that. That Sally Mae is a fine-looking filly. Go to Philadelphia. Is a fine-looking filly. Yeah. Right. Good job. What happened next? Well, it came over here and there was... The bank robber. Actually, this was the bank teller. Oh, what yeah. the bank teller look like? Well, she was adorable. She had ears and a crown on and a little Tinkerbell <laughs> shirt. Oh, oh right look, there. she's right there. That's the bank yeah. teller, everybody. Come on up. Here we are. Come on up. There, there you go. Now, look here. This bank teller, she was kind of sassy, if you know what I mean. And this is what she I said. She said, howdy. Howdy. 
Yeah, she said open a new account. Open a new account. And get a free churro. Woo. Get a free churro. Yeah, yeah. real good, real good. Honey, let's take you from the top so nobody forgets nothing. Good idea, Clem. Ah, sashayed into the bank and the bank manager said... <laughs> that Sally Mae is a fine looking filly. So when I come by, just check me out. Your lines will come to you. <laughs> Came over here and the teller says, open a new account. Get a free. Yeah, there we go. Grab over here and there was. The bank robber. No, Daddy, the town drunk. The town drunk, huh? Oh, honey, you got several to choose from. Yeah, I know, but it's that Angry Birds fella back there. Come on up. Give a round of applause, everybody. <laughs> all right, now look here. Stand right over here. Now this town drunk, he'd been drinking all morning. No matter what anybody said, he would just yell out real loud, I'll drink to that. Watch this. Hey there. I'll drink to that. Yeah. Somebody's done that before. That's the real thing, yeah. Here we go. I sashayed into the bank, and the bank manager said, That Sally is a fine-looking... Really? <laughs> That's all right, I'll take it. <laughs> you start to relax a little bit. I like that. Came over here and the teller said, Howdy. Come on in and uh, open an account and get a free shirt. Yeah. yeah. Taking it real good. Came over here and the town drunk said, I'll drink to that. <laughs> I know you'd get your line right. <laughs> Came over here and there was. Well, of course, the bank robber. Why do you think we're doing this? I don't know. I've been having drinks with the drunk. All right. Well, look, I don't know what this bank robber looked like because he was wearing a mask, but I'd recognize that voice if and I heard it again because it was me. Me. It was Henri. Henri. It was this kid right here. Uh -huh. Backfired on you a little, didn't it? Now, this bank robber, he had his guns out. Get your guns out. And he said in a loud, mean voice, he says, Hands up. Hands up. <laughs> Real good. Real good. He said, you mangy yeller varmints. You mangy yellow varmints. This here's a hold up. This here's a hold up. Yeah. Yeah. Nice job. Real good. Real good. I'll drink to that. <laughs> I'm not drinking it now. <laughs> you are so proud of yourself right now. Aren't you? second part. He says, and be snappy about it. And be snappy about it. Or I'll blast you full of holes. Oh, I'll blast you full of holes. And you'll look like Swiss cheese. And you'll look like Swiss cheese. Oh, so good. I'll drink that. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> we need to get on a program. Exactly. <laughs> the last part. It's real easy. You'll get it. No problem. He says, and a band, a band, and a word, jump, we draw a big pie box, and then I made you stone no boots on your feet. <laughs> you work on that. We'll yeah. be back. All right, here we go. Let's solve this caper. Ah, sashayed into the bank, and the bank manager said, that Sally B is a fine-looking Billy. 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 <laughs> <laughs> I know you like me. <laughs> Came over here, and the teller says, how is And then he says it again. I'll drink to that. Then he says it in Spanish. That'll shut you up. Came <laughs> <laughs> over here the bank robber had him. Hey, 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 to the 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 help you. Let me help you, son. Let me help you. Oh, it on, went on. like this. It went handsome. Yellow makes you promise. Here's a whole other movie set. I don't know. Blast it so full of hoes. You're going to look like Swiss cheese. And I'm going to play a pan. And I'm going to roll. And I'm going to make my box. And then I'm going to no boots on your feet. Like that, everybody. I said I'd recognize that voice. It was you. You are the bank robber. Sam, you're the bank robber. I'm the sheriff. You're under arrest. I'm not going anywhere. Hands up. Hands up. Hands up. Oh, Sally, honey, hands down. Hands down. <laughs> Sorry. 
Yeah. Yes, friends, it's true. I'm the bank robber, but I did it out of a father's love. I mean, how else was I going to finance my political career and have money to pay for Sally Mae's beauty school? Oh, yeah. Well, you're going to have to rob a couple more banks. All right. right. <laughs> now, listen, I am a politician, and when it comes to matters of money and finance, you know, we never lie. So I, I promise to... Quiet. Now, I promise to give me back all the money if you forget me. What do you say? Do you forget me? No! Oh, you people are tough. You heard it, Mayor. The people of Frontierland have spoken. You want to see the mayor go to jail? Yeah! yeah. Gee, Lucy. I'll drink to that. I thought you would. Let's have a big round of applause. Criminals go. Wait, wait. Oh, all right. Uh oh, uh oh.